let's get granular. I like that. Can we just? So in the blog this month, we spoke about granular strategy. For those of you that may have missed it, CCB is here to give us a summary. Okay, so for all of you lazy readers out there, um, I thought I'd just give you a quick take on what the blog was about. But for those that want to read it in a lot more detail, you can catch our link below. So basically, when you speak about granular strategy, we know that companies generally have a high level strategy. This might be their business strategy, and they may even take it that step down to having different departments having their strategy, such as your marketing department having their strategy. However, when we speak about a granular strategy, what we are saying is that each component of your marketing strategy needs to have its own little strategy within itself. So that's what we mean by when we say, let's get granular. Awesome. Thanks for the summary. So I'm sure you're asking yourselves, how do we implement it and where do we start? So yeah, that very much is the age-old question of how do I? We learn these great concepts all the time, but the question is always, well, how do I do this? You know, um, What's the point of learning something if you don't actually know how to take it to the next step? Mm -hmm. So I think that the how do you implement it um, we need to look at where does one actually start and generally a lot of people have this part in play already where you start is understanding what the overall business strategy is for your company and what their goals are only once you understand that can you actually start aligning what your strategy is going to bring to the overall business goal so a lot of times sometimes the departments are treated as separate silos but it, you're all working together towards the same goal so the big thing that you need to understand is what is your entire business's goal for whether it's a quarter or a year or three years or five years and only from there can you actually start putting your own strategies and therefore granular strategies together thank you so I think the best way to explain it to everyone is for you to give us an example. Yes, it's normally the best way that anybody understands anything. So that's quite a complex subject. So let's try, I'm going to use Metis as a bit of an example because we understand PPC. So I'm just going to go down that route. Mm. But if we start at the top, um, your business will come to you with a business goal. It will be something like, we want to increase our net profit by 20% for the year. Now each department within the business would then go away and put together a strategy of how they're gonna make a contribution to it. Um, so everybody always immediately thinks sales, but it could be different things. It could be the finance department looks at what costs to cut. Mm. The operations department may look at um, how to streamline their project management so they, get, um, they can get more work out in a short amount of time. So everybody will look at their contribution. Within marketing, possibly your goal would be to get 100 leads per month for the company for the sales department so that would that would be like the marketing goal and then there needs to be a strategy behind it and this is where we start getting granular so marketing will say we have five different strategies on how to do this we are going to have a referral program we're going to attend networking events mm -hmm. we are going to have a content marketing plan we are going to do pay-per-click and we're going to do SEO so now they've basically put their strategies but each of those channels within themselves now also need a strategy. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to go down the route of PPC just because I understand it the best. Mm -hmm. So now we go into PPC and they go, okay, well, what platforms are we going to be utilizing in pay-per-click? Mm -hmm. So they might decide, I'm going to use LinkedIn, and I'm going to use Facebook, and I'm going to use Google Search and Google Display. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. But what's your strategy for each of those platforms? Mm -hmm. So now we go one step further again. Now we go Google Search. What is our strategy there? And we understand our resources, we understand our budget. So we might go, well, we need the campaign structure to look a certain way. And then even going one further, you, you will say something to the effect of, we need to have a location strategy. What locations are we going to target and what locations don't we want to be showing in? Or how are we going to speak to our different audiences within this PPC strategy? So there's now a copy strategy attached to audiences. Mm -hmm. And as you can hear, every single level as we're going down essentially has a strategy attached to it. That is having a granular strategy. That makes sense. I think you guys need to get your pen and papers out because now you're going to get the key components of granular strategy. So if I had to put out the key components of how to follow a granular strategy, the first thing that you need to do is understand your own business's goals and what the business strategy is. 
from there, you need to understand what your different goals are going to be for your marketing strategy in this particular case, or whatever department you're running, and how you're going to measure those different goals. You cannot measure all types of strategies the same way. Mm -hmm. For something, it might be maybe views in a video, but for another thing, it could be the amount of leads that come in. Thirdly, I would take a look at um, the different platforms that you can utilize. We need to know how to use those platforms to the absolute fullest to be able to know how we're going to strategize within that platform, mm -hmm. know what its capabilities of. The next thing is definitely just to keep up to date with the latest trends and new features that come out, especially for the platforms that you're utilizing. Because as you go forward, and this is the last point, is you want to be measuring and adjusting and tweaking your strategy in real time. We can't wait a year from now and then go, oh, that didn't work. What we can do is we can measure as we're going around and we can tweak, but tweak at granular level. I think too often people will say, oh, Facebook marketing is not working for me and just can it. Instead of actually looking at the different granular strategies and going, well, let us look at our copywriting strategy. Maybe that's the element that's not working and we can tweak and measure and move on. Thanks, Chantal. So if you find... <laughs> so what is it again? <laughs> <laughs> so if you found today. Oh, so. If you enjoyed today's content, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive notifications the next time we release some awesome content. Thanks bye -bye. for watching. Thanks for watching. <laughs>